welcome back to my channel and if you're new my name is Makai Michelle so today I'm coming to y'all live from my new car yeah so if you didn't know now you know I recently got a new car it's a 2018 Honda Civic LX something like that and so I've been dying to decorate it and I want to take y'all along on the journey with me so today that's what we're gonna be doing and I'm not even gonna talk too much I'm ready to get straight into it okay all right y'all so first hold on this was something I was the most excited for. It's just this little steering wheel and it's pink and bedazzled. So that's the color like theme that we're going for my car. Very much pink, girly, glitter, and black. Okay, so I'm going to put this on the steering wheel right now. I put it on the other day when I first got it because I want to see if it would fit because it was looking huge. But then when I put it on, I put it on crooked. So hold on, let me start the car and straighten the steering wheel. Anyways, when I put it on, I had put it on crooked and it was really, really bothering me. So I was just like, forget it, I'll just take it off. And then when I do the video, I'll put it on. So this on straight or else that is going to be killing me. And it's so like, lots of people were saying it's difficult to put on. I don't think it's that difficult. It took me like three minutes, but I was struggling for those three minutes, okay? Because very much these nails and I got one that's lifting real bad, that joint hurt. Ow! <laughs> Okay guys, so after about five minutes, I finally got it on. When I tell you, between having these long nails, one of them being one that's lifting really bad and hurts so freaking bad, this was terrible to put on. The first time, it was not as hard for me, but it's super duper cute, I love it. But that joint hurt, like my nail really bent. Oh! It's very, very cute, like look at it, I'm loving it. I love the pink steering wheel she's giving, Barbie dreams, yup, Barbie tings. I forgot to do this at the beginning of the video, but now that the steering wheel's out of the way, let's jump into why I got from Bath & Body Works for my car. I just feel like as girls, we just need certain essentials for our car to make sure that we're good wherever we go. My favorite scent right now from Bath & Body Works is Strawberry Pound Cake. It smells so good. I originally got the candle and I was looking, I'm like, oh my gosh, where is the scent for this? Like, do they have a body spray? Do they have a lotion? Let me know. And then I went online and they didn't have it in stock, but I went to the mall. I looked for like, last month but i went to the mall and baby they had it okay so not only did i get one for my car i got one for my house too because i need to be smelling like this every single day so i got the body spray and i also got the strawberry pound cake body cream and for my car i also got the body cream and just a mini spray to keep in here you know if i'm looking a little bit ashy if i forgot to put perfume on or anything like that i have these right here for me to use when i tell y'all all the stuff i got came up to like 40 dollars, and that was after the coupon i don't know how it came up to that much because with all the sales they was telling me they had and with the coupons that I had, I was like, oh bet it's looking like a good twenty dollars. Actually, it should have been free. It should have been free with all the sales they was giving. All the sales they was giving, it should have been free. I saw fifty dollars. I said, oh, I got a coupon. Because what? It's giving scam. How, how y'all did that to me and I didn't even notice? I literally hate the new car smell. It gives me very much dentist. I don't like that smell at all. So I got some car refills from them and the lady was telling me, she's like, no, these will actually, the lady was telling me, she was like, no, these will actually have your car smelling mad good. Like they actually work for real. I'm like, good, because I freaking hate that new car smell. It smells like a dentist in here. I don't like that. So this is just the little thing that you put it in and you connect it to your vent, I guess. I don't know, I don't even know how I'm gonna connect this to my vent because I'm gonna have to look it up. But I got two vanilla bean scents and one pumpkin pecan waffle. I'm probably gonna save that until it's like fall time. So I'm not really sure how I'll use this. We finna figure it out right now. I have to peel this. Peel when ready to use, okay. Okay, you got it, kid. Hold on. I really don't know what the hell to do with this. There's a whole YouTube on the installation of this. That's how I know it don't make no sense. It goes on your visor? What? I'm thinking it goes in my air vent because usually, and that's where it goes, but I guess not. They said to put it on my visor like this, and that makes much more sense because y'all see how that just goes on. I mean, I guess, but I don't know how I'm gonna smell it that well. I just want to make my car smell like vanilla cupcakes and strawberry sprinkles, it's whatever. But I also got the hand sanitizer because baby, we still in the panoramic. So we gotta have our hand sanitizer, okay? And I'm just gonna put this exactly where I put the lotion and the body spray and all that right here in the center console. Oh my gosh, it's called the center console. Look at me, I'm so smart. Eh, I, like, how did I know that? And then from Target, I just picked up this mini spray deodorant because y'all, don't call me dirty. But there's mad times I walked out the house and went, oh my gosh, I didn't put on deodorant. And that's just a hassle, babes. So we got some spray deodorant right here to pop right in the center console just with everything out. What we're not gonna do is get my car dirty. Which leads me to the next item! So y'all, 
next thing I got for my car is this mini trash can because what we're not gonna do is get the new car dirty, okay? Oh, I didn't even tell you my car's name. My car's name is Chloe. So we're not gonna get Chloe dirty at all. We need to keep a trash can in here. So I'm just gonna put this on the cup holder on my side and I'm gonna just be, so I'm, um, the trash can don't fit in my cup holders. Let me try the ones in the back. All right, so it kind of fits the one in the back. It's still hanging a little bit, but for the most part, this is good. I can deal with that. I can't believe it ain't fit up here. That's crazy. I'm sorry if the line starts to get weird throughout this video. It's about to be sundown, but let's get on to the rest of the items. Oh no, this works, y'all. I smell it. This works for real. Now, this is actually gonna fit in the vent. This is just my like car phone holder, car phone car holder car phone holder this is my car phone holder because i just need to not be looking down at my phone like i need to keep my eyes up and on the road how do i put this in here i'll just pop it in here okay like i don't have time for the stress right now bro what the f go the f in <laughs> period so y'all here's where my phone will go how cute where's my phone bro oh it's right here oh it's upside down and you just clamp the sides. Turn on! But yeah, that's where my phone go purr, purr. Now my car doesn't have a place for the aux to go, but this right here is just my phone charger and also like an extra USB cord and stuff like that, just in case like somebody else needs to charge their phone in my car. And like I told y'all, I got everything in black or glitter and pink, so these are just some black chargers. Period, let's charge the phone right now. Yeah, yeah, I get to charge it. Oh, I almost forgot, okay. So this right here is a gap filler. It goes like right between your center console and your chair just so nothing falls in there. And if it does, this will catch it. And it's also like an extra cup holder right here and stuff like that. I'm gonna see if this is gonna fit because of course it fits and it's cute. Hold on. And of course I had to get mine all blinged out so it's real cute, okay? It's really cute and you just put it right here just like that. So right here, these are some hooks just to hang up my purse and coat, like whatever else is in my car that I need to hang up. I can use these crystal hooks for them. I'm sure you guys have seen these on TikTok. They're pretty popular. I'm gonna show y'all right now why I took them out the package. They just look like this, and I'm gonna put them right here on my headrest. This side, hold on. How do I put them on? Hold on, baby. How do I touch it through like this? Like, cause my headrest is low. Yeah. And now we can get this bag off the floor because best believe it was just on the floor and everything was spilling out of it. I got my purse. Where's the other strap? Oh, it's right here. And look at those little bedazzled hooks. Hopefully it doesn't swing too much. It looks good though. And that looks so cute. Hold on. Oh my gosh. Mad cute. Cute little hooks also mean I have to break my arm to reach to the back seat anymore because that was never giving, okay? It was only two days because I got this car two days ago. Baby, I got Prime. One to two day shipping. Stop playing with me. It'll come tomorrow or it'll come the day after that. Yeah, and these stuff, like those little two days was a little bit too much. So, I had to get the hooks. Oh my gosh, y'all. I did almost forgot about these. These are coasters and they're pink and blinked out. Once again, you know we got a theme going on. I told y'all pink, glitter, and black. So these are just little coasters. I'm gonna take them out the package once again to show y'all. Y'all, what kind of time is this? Is these Savorsky's crystals? Because the way they hand the light, oh, it's giving. But look at these, y'all. These are so cute. I was gonna get the light up ones, but I'm already gonna have my lights in my car. That's next. Ah! I'm already gonna have my lights in the car and I didn't want to have to charge the lights or have the lights plugged in and have the coasters plugged in so that was like OD. So let's put these coasters in right now. I'm just gonna pop them right here in my cup holders and they fit perfectly. So there, y'all know, there goes my body spray, my hand sanitizer, my lotion, my deodorant, and the little car smelling things. And then right here are the coasters. How cute are they? They're so cute. Okay guys, so that's pretty much it for the decor part, okay? What we're doing next are my car's lights, okay? So these are actually Bluetooth connected to my phone and I just have to plug it into my USB port in my car and they'll light up. But these are um, Bluetooth, so I can control the brightness, the setting, all of that on my phone. Everything will be linked down below, by the way. But I'm just gonna go ahead and plug these in and get them hooked up right now. So what you do is you put two in the front and then you have it looped around to the back and then you put two in the back but you make sure you loop it in the center console because i saw some girl on youtube loop it like the opposite way so it was like wires on the outside of her car and that's giving very much safety hazard so make sure you loop it through the center okay guys so i look like i just been through a war and back 
but baby it took me a minute to get this done okay very much it wasn't hard i'm just slow so i kept getting the cords all tangled and stuff like that um but other than that it was it was fine but it just took me a long time because that nail is hurting like y'all don't even understand but anyways okay y'all so the wires are going all through here the light is down there we have a light down here and we also have a light in the back and you see i would just put the wires like underneath the mat tuck them in so everything just looks neat okay y'all so we got the app right here as you can see they're off but i just plugged them in and now it's time for the moment of truth hmm why they ain't turn away I messed with the brightness and the lights are on, baby. They're on, okay? It was just a little too bright out here. So I'm gonna have to come back to y'all when it's nighttime so y'all can see it in action. But best believe those lights is on. Those lights is okay, on. Okay, guys, so that's pretty much it for decorating my car. I'm gonna be back to give you guys a little bit of a car tour so y'all can see everything in action as well as show y'all my lights a little bit later. So I will see y'all soon. No, it's really this light shine off my oily ass forehead for me. Like, what's going on? But okay guys, clearly it's later on in the night, so of course you know I have to show y'all these lights in my car. They're so cute. Look. Yeah, Chloe, you better act up, act up, you can get snatched up. Yeah. Look at Chloe lighting up and all that, okay? So, yeah, they're cute. They're really cute. And they're not too bright to the point where it's like distracting me while I'm driving. Like, hold on, where's my phone at? Let's change colors right now. Um, come on, face ID. Act like you got sense. Thank you. Mm. Y'all see Miss Minaj? Hold on. Y'all see Miss Minaj right there? And where else she at? Ah, my good sis. Yeah. Okay, y'all. What color we want? We want pink. Yeah. Look at that. Look at that. Rainbow, rainbow, rainbow. Red is dark. But y'all can still see it. You can see it. She on demon time. Oh. Oh, she on demon time. Her demon time ain't nothing nice. Stop playing. But guys, that's it for my decorating my car with me. I hope you guys are ready for all the drive with me, all the fun things we got going on, okay? Because our car is just too cute, okay? Chloe is for all of us. Now I'm lying, because I'm the only one driving her. She's not for everybody. But she, she don't get like that. She's not for the streets. I mean, she's going to be in the streets, but she's not for the streets. If you guys enjoyed this video, please don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. Comment down below. Tell me how much you enjoyed. As well as subscribe to my channel. And hit the bell so you're notified every time I post new content. Can I forget to follow me on all my social media? They're always listed down below. That will give you the behind the scenes of every video. With all that being said, I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I hope to see you in the next one. Bye. Mwah.